diabetes take you out because it will. It causes all sorts of problems. Don't sleep on it. Don't just have it and think that it's gonna go away. They call high blood pressure, hypertension, whichever one you wanna call it, they call it the silent killer for a reason because it will kill you. It causes, it causes strokes, it causes many problems. You know, it affects your kidneys. I'm talking about hypertension, high blood pressure. It affects all of those organs. If it doesn't kill you right away with a stroke, it can hurt you over time by tearing your kidneys up. And then once you get chronic kidney disease, it's not like it goes away. You either have stage one, two, three, according to the damage that was done. It's not just gonna go away once they get damaged, okay? Yeah, you got two kidneys, but if both of them is damaged, you're in trouble. Do not sleep on this, these chronic diseases. Don't sleep on them at all. I, I have had high blood pressure for a very long time. Uh, you know, didn't address it because didn't know I had it. Uh, didn't know why I had headaches all the time. Didn't know why I felt the way I felt. You know, until I went in one day and they, it was 200 over 103. I was pretty bad. I was pretty bad. They told me I was, I was in a stroke territory and they surprised, they, they were surprised that I had not already had one. I'm telling you, don't do it. Don't do it. That was just God right there. <laughs> but, don't, but don't do it because these chronic diseases would take you out. The number one health preventive medicine is exercise. Well, what turned my situation around? Because I, 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 I was diagnosed with chronic kidney disease. I was diagnosed with high blood pressure. I do not have diabetes, but I was borderline. You know, I looked okay, and that's the thing. I looked okay, but I was sick inside. I was about the same size as I am now, but I wasn't working out. At that time, I had stopped working out for years. I was a city mail carrier. So I do a little walking here, you know, there's a difference between work and actually working out. You know, when you work out, you get your heart rate up to a certain rate. I'm talking about with cardio, and you keep it up there for a minimum of 30 minutes to make your heart rate work versus walking and stopping and sitting down, walking and stopping and sitting down. That's it's a difference, okay? Okay, it's a big difference between work and working out, a job, okay? So fitness, fitness is what's going to turn things around for you. You know, whether you're doing cardio, whether you're at home working out, or whether you're in the gym. You know, myself, I put in at least, at least 45 minutes to an hour a day working out. And when I go walk, my minimum is 20,000 steps. 20,000 steps on my cardio day. That's what I do. And this is this is my what I do for me. You know, if you want to do 10,000, that's fine. But that's the standards when you look, when you read all of the standards or whatever, you know, the 10 to 12,000 range. Here at Master Fitness, I believe 20,000 because 20,000 has worked for me. My kidney situation is stabilized. Uh, it has moved in up. It has went down, but it has not moved up. So my situation is stabilized because of fitness and nutrition. That's the only thing. And then, of course, you know, up above, looking down on me as well. So all of that helps. But once again, do not take these chronic diseases lightly. Uh, it's uh, very prevalent in my family. I'm talking about, you know, high blood pressure, diabetes. Uh, unfortunately, I've been to a lot of funerals. Uh, do not take this lightly. You know, it's going to continue to do what it does. It has been winning for years. It's going to keep winning and preying on people who do not take care of themselves. Because if you want to fight it, you want to fight back, start, start working out. Get your workout plan. Start getting out here walking at least a minimum do the 10,000 steps. You know, everybody may not want to do 20,000 like me, but get the minimum in. Get the minimum, the minimum standard in. But just don't sit there and take it because you sit here and think you're just going to take it 
and you just going to be all right, you are wrong. You're not just going to be all right. This is Master Fitness, the building of a machine. <laughs>